How you doing, folks? It's Andrew Martin, the magician. Uh, today, we're going to talk about the late, great Mr. John Calvert. Uh, boy, John was a character. He loved my son, Eli. Uh, he he's uh, he's been over to the house uh, as you as you can see here. Whoops! There's uh, uh, John uh, signed uh, signed my book in 2002, and I also kept the uh, uh, <laughs> dollar dollar bill and something else fell out. No, that was it. Okay, uh, and, and John Calvert. Uh, I remember. Um, Oh, I, I don't know. I, it was like 19, maybe 1998, 1999. I, I just said to myself, I got to meet this guy, John Kelvert. And sure enough, he, he came to Toledo and uh, uh, there, uh, there is uh, me and, uh, and my wife, Melissa, and John and Tammy and uh, a group of magicians we went out to this Italian restaurant here in Toledo, uh, Mancy's Italian. And uh, uh, John was talking about uh, exchanging magic lessons for chiro chiropractic lessons. And my wife, Melissa, said, you know, my husband, Andy, he's been having neck problems. So we're in this restaurant, and John gets up, and he goes, well, I'll fix that. And he took my neck, and he cracked. I mean, he cracked my neck. You could hear it throughout the restaurant. Everybody stopped what they were doing. And John goes, that should take care of it. <laughs> but uh, John, oh, my goodness. I mean, he just adored my son. Oh, uh, I just had it here just two seconds ago. Okay, and uh, where did it go? It was right here. Oh, there it is. Looking for a picture. And uh, there's uh, there's my son Eli with John Calvert at our house. Uh, apparently that that's Eli's autograph when he was <laughs> that age. I don't know how he... This is the first time I've ever seen that. But uh, he came over to his house. He, he adored Eli. He, uh, during his lecture, he stopped the lecture and he brought up Eli and he shook his hand. He says, You're, this, this young man's going to be one of the great magicians of all time. You'll hear more about him. And uh, it, was, it was such a treat. And uh, here we are at uh, Dave Simon's uh, Magic Studio. Uh, Dave Simon, uh, unfortunately, he passed away uh, when he was 50. He had a magic shop on Sylvania Avenue, same as Ted Carruthers Magic Studio. I'll talk, talk about that one of these days. But uh, here's my buddy, uh, Myron St. John and uh, John Kelbert. And here is... Uh, My good friend Dave Simon, who owned the shop with John Kelvert, and uh, you probably, you guys, some of you guys probably know Patrick, who makes those wonderful close-up pads. Well, there's uh, Patrick and I tying up uh, John Kelvert, and also in uh, in his lecture, John showed how to get out of a hundred foot, hundred feet foot of rope, and he put me in. And uh, I learned how to got, get out of the rope. And that was the last time I ever did that because I really don't do escapes. So, um, oh, great memories of uh, John Kelvert and, and Tammy coming over. And, um, oh, yes, uh, one other thing I want to mention because this is not in the book. It, it mentioned something in the book, but... You know, I wrote this down, and I put it uh, in an index card, and uh, there's uh, there's the great Jack Gwynn. Whoa, my book's falling apart. There he is, the great Jack Gwynn. And uh, 
And this is what I wrote uh, June 25th. Hey, June 25th, uh, 2002. I wrote this on the uh, index card. Uh, I asked, uh, asked Calvert if Jack Gwynn was mad at him. Uh, and he said no. Uh, right away, he phoned Gwynn and told him that he picked up the phone as, at his house. Because he, he picked up a phone. He, was, he went to visit Jack Gwynn. And the phone rang, and I don't know if he was in the house or they had an outside phone or what what what's go what was going on. But he he picked up the phone and uh, told told him it was uh, MGM casting, uh, and uh, you know Jack Quinn said you know uh, hey I I wasn't there so you know good luck and. Um, yeah, John Calvert told me that Ben Pavis, the casting director at MGM, saw Calvert's show. So he knew who Calvert uh, was in St. Louis. And that's how he knew uh, that uh, Calvert was the man. So a uh, little extra information that is not in the, William Rauscher's uh, uh, book about uh, the great John Calvert. So that's my, uh, those are my wonderful stories about John. Uh, I miss him. I miss talking to him. He was uh, just a great guy and a great magician. Oh, I'll tell you what. I'll post another story about John Calvert later. Take care. Bye-bye.